Before computers, calculations were done by hand. This was slow and prone to errors. People used slide rules and mechanical calculators to help, but these had limits. The need for faster, more accurate calculations grew, especially during World War II, when complex problems arose in areas like ballistics and code breaking. The war pushed for innovation. Governments and scientists sought new technologies to gain an edge. This led to the development of the first electronic computers, marking a turning point in history. These early machines were behemoths, filling entire rooms with their intricate workings. They relied on a new technology, the vacuum tube. World War II demanded complex calculations, artillery trajectories, code deciphering, and research required immense computational power. Existing methods proved insufficient for the task. This urgent need became a catalyst for rapid technological advancement. Governments invested heavily in research and development. Scientists and engineers collaborated on ambitious projects to create machines capable of handling these calculations. This period of intense innovation laid the groundwork for the first generation of computers. First generation computers relied on vacuum tubes. These glass tubes controlled the flow of electricity, acting as electronic switches. Thousands of vacuum tubes were needed for even basic operations. These tubes generated significant heat, requiring elaborate cooling systems Connecting these tubes were miles of wires and circuits. Programming involved physically manipulating these connections. The sheer number of components made these computers massive, often occupying entire rooms. Despite their size and limitations, they represented a monumental leap forward in computing technology. Alan Turing, a British mathematician, played a crucial role. He developed the concept of a universal machine that could perform any computation. This theoretical model, known as the Turing machine, became fundamental to computer science. During World War II, Turing's work at Bletchley Park proved crucial in breaking German codes. His contributions extended beyond wartime, laying the foundation for modern computing. His legacy continues to inspire generations of computer scientists. Section 5 John von Neumann, Architect of Thought John von Neumann, a Hungarian-American mathematician, made significant contributions to the architecture of computers. He proposed the stored program concept, where instructions and data are stored in the computer's memory. This architecture, known as the von Neumann architecture, revolutionized computer design. It allowed for greater flexibility and efficiency in programming. Most modern computers still follow the principles outlined by von Neumann, highlighting his lasting impact on the field. Section 6, ENIAC, a Colossus of Calculation. The Electronic Numerical Integrator and Computer, or ENIAC, was one of the first general-purpose electronic computers. Completed in 1945, ENIAC was massive, weighing over 30 tons and occupying 1,800 square feet. ENIAC could perform complex calculations thousands of times faster than previous methods. It was primarily used for military applications, including calculating ballistic trajectories, and designing the hydrogen bomb. ENIAC's development marked a pivotal moment in computing history. Section 7, UNIVAC, ushering in the computer age. The universal automatic computer, known as UNIVAC, 
was another groundbreaking machine. Unlike ENIAC, which was primarily for military use, UNIVAC was designed for commercial applications. UNIVAC could handle both numerical and textual data, making it suitable for a wider range of tasks. It was used for census data processing, election predictions, and other business applications. UNIVAC's success marked the beginning of the computer's transition from a specialized tool to a more widespread technology. Section 8. Challenges of the Giants First-generation computers, while groundbreaking, face significant challenges. Their reliance on vacuum tubes made them unreliable and prone to overheating. Programming was a tedious process involving manual manipulation of wires and switches. These computers were also incredibly expensive to build and maintain. Their size and power requirements made them impractical for widespread use. Despite these limitations, they paved the way for future advancements in computer technology. Section 9 The Enduring Legacy First-generation computers laid the foundation for the digital age. They demonstrated the potential of electronic computing and sparked further innovation. The concepts and technologies developed during this era continue to influence modern computing. From the Turing machine to the von Neumann architecture, these early pioneers shaped the future of technology. Their work paved the way for the smaller, faster, and more accessible computers we have today. The legacy of first-generation computers lives on in every aspect of our digital world.